Before I started working on Mito, this is what making pivot tables in Python was like for me. Okay, I imported pandas as PD. Now I'm reading in this CSV as a data frame. Let me look at the data frame. I can only really see eight rows of the 854, but okay, I guess I kind of get an idea of the data here. And now let me think of what pivot table I want to make. Um, I went to the pandas documentation just to get the syntax because I always forget it. So let me run this. Here's our pivot table. Um, I mean, I can definitely see the data, but it's not really much I can do besides look at it. I kind of want to investigate it more and it's, and it's hard to do. Okay, here's making a pivot table in Mito. One, import the Mito sheet package. Now I'm going to call Mito sheet.sheet, which is our front end. Instead of having to read in the file manually, I can just select whatever file I want, CSV import it, it automatically turns it into a data frame and generates the code that turns the CSV into a data frame. I'm gonna close this. Nice thing here is I can look at way more than just a few rows of my data. I can really investigate it. If I wanna look at summary statistics for any column, let's look at these divisions. Let's see the frequencies for these. Cool, we can see which, div which divisions are most frequent and least frequent. I'll close this. Now let's do a quick pivot table. I just have these states here. Let's see how many zip codes I have in each state. Click my pivot button. As my row, I'll put state. As my value, I'll put zip. And then I want the count aggregation method right here. And here's our pivot table. Super easy to look through and understand. And I can also dig deeper here. Let's say I want to just look at states that have M in it. I want to apply a filter here. Add filter, M. Here's the subset of the data we're interested in. And now if I scroll below, we see we generated the code for that pivot table and for the filter. And let's say I want to graph it as well. Apply graph, x-axis state, y-axis zip, and here's a graph of our pivot table. Really simple, easy to use, by far the fastest way to pivot in Python.